Dick was getting this idea of this cool ghoul character, but he needed a half a wig. Orange, reddish. We had just had a client, a customer in the wig business, who'd had an automobile accident. He went to up to the theatrical company and uh, talked to John Shins, and he said, I need just this half. He said, say no more. He said, this is driving these women crazy that work here. Come back in a week and I'll have it. And my partner as a makeup artist had been asked to do the makeup job in the coffin. And she, the woman, wore wigs all the time. So he took one of her wigs and cut it in half and put the front half of the wig on the corpse in the coffin. And we had the back half of this wig sitting around there. So Dick goes back, and sure enough, here's this beautiful orangish red half wig. He said, well, that's great, exactly what I need. He says, yeah, just get it out of here. He says, well, what's the story on this? The front half of that wig was on a corpse in the graves. Dick didn't know that for years. That was the cool ghoul's wig that he wore underneath that hat when he went... <laughs>